question for today is, is it, uh, is it proper to uh, mock the COVID deniers who've died? Is that proper? Is that what she, you should be doing? Yeah, I'm uh, pretty much on one side of it. Yeah, I'm going to mock the hell out of them. You know why? Because they're smarter than us. Yeah, they're also dead. But, you know, maybe in polite society, it's probably not proper to mock the dead of COVID when they were out there saying, uh, like one old boy, he was saying he was, uh, he was worried about the Democrat in the White House. The COVID didn't scare him. Well, he's dead to the COVID. Kind of like uh, dancing on somebody's grave. But you know what it comes down to is they're freaking stupid. So when we're mocking them, we're not mocking them about dying of the COVID. We're mocking mocking them because uh, they're fucking stupid. They're freaking stupid. Yeah, that old gal out in California the other day, you know, she... Uh, she fought that COVID. She wouldn't wear a mask. You know, she she ran out there and run her mouth about, oh, it's a hoax and all that kind of shit, you know. But she's dead now, too. So, uh, yeah, I, I think I'm going to mock her. Yeah, you really showed us, didn't you? <laughs> You're fucking dead, but, yeah, you showed us. You had to die to show us, though. But, you know, the smart people... We're listening to the damn experts in the field. We were listening to what they said. When they say wear a, wear a face covering when you're out in public, good idea. Get a vaccination. Yeah, good idea. You need to do that. And we fully understand that, you know, even if you got vaccinated and you're wearing a face mask, that, yeah, you can still get the stuff. But, uh, the experts are saying, even if you get the stuff, it's not going to be that bad that you ought to be able to recover from it. <laughs> but mocking those old uh, men and women over on the right that, that they're too fucking stupid to understand they were stupid. Mocking them. Yeah, I'm going to mock them. I'm going to mock the piss out of them. Oh, yeah. You, you showed us, didn't you? <laughs> You showed us as your family's burying your stupid ass because you're too fucking stupid. But that's what it is. You know, it's just abject stupidity that you don't listen to the doctors and the scientists to say, yeah, you need to, you need to take some precautions here. And then what makes it worse, what really makes it worse, is they were out there telling other people, no, don't don't listen to those experts. Don't listen to those scientists. You know, don't don't listen to them. They don't know what they were doing. That's what we keep being told all the time. Yeah, yeah, the experts and the doctors they don't know what they're doing. It's those uh those stupid Trump pumpers out there saying, oh yeah, that COVID. Oh, don't worry about that. Don't wear that face covering. You know, don't get that vaccination. It's nothing to worry about. <clears throat> like that one guy said he was more worried about the Democrat in the White House than he was COVID. Well, the Democrat in the White House didn't kill his stupid ass. He did that all by himself with the COVID. That he had ample warning. Ample warning. You know, that shit was killing people. Still is. It may feel like right now that, well, maybe we're over it, but, you know, that shit's still out there. It's still out there, and it's still killing people. But I think uh, I think we ought to be able to, to mock them. Yeah, we're mocking their stupidity. They paid for it with their freaking lives. That stupid stuff, yeah, they died stupid. So we ought to be able to point that out. So maybe other people will look over and say, you know, uh, that person was denying the COVID, was uh, denying all the scientists and the doctors, and now they're dead. Maybe we ought to learn from that. So that's why we are to mock them. They die of COVID after telling us, you know, did, uh, that they was more worried about the Democrat in the White House than they were to COVID, and now they're dead. Yeah, we ought to be able to point that out. So maybe the rest of them will stop and think, you know, uh, 
maybe I ought to listen to the damn scientist so you don't get put six foot under for being fucking stupid. But that's what you get over in the right. It's all stupid shit. But yeah, they'll tell you how smart they are. Oh, they're so damn smart. Yeah, they're saying no, no, that COVID, don't worry about that. And then they die from the freaking COVID. And I'm looking at it and say, you know, you're one dumb motherfucker. Huh? Is, is that is that how you uh you tell your kids, you know, to be stupid? Because stupid has consequences. And in your case, you COVID deniers, the consequence was you're dead. And I'm going to mock your stupidity. Because that's what it is. Stupidity. Which, uh, on the right, yeah, that's a uh, bona fides there. <laughs> so yeah, you out there, uh, you out there mocking the COVID like it's nothing that kills people, and then you die from it. Yeah, we ought to be able to mock your stupid ass dancing on somebody's grave. That's what they're gonna say. I'm dancing on somebody's grave, but you know I'm dancing on their fucking stupidity. And that's what you got to do with the rights. You got to point out their damn stupidity. They ain't don't won't do them any damn good. But maybe somebody out there, kind of sitting on the fence, will look at it and say, you know, um, I think I'm going to get that vaccine. I think I want to live instead of die. Oh boy, yeah, he was worried about the Democrat in the White House is going to kill him. But you know, the COVID got his ass. He's fucking stupid, and I'll mock him. From now on, yep, you showed us, showed us right into a fucking casket.